Clarivane is a new procedure. It's been out maybe for a year or so. It is a procedure that is associated with less pain, uh, both during the procedure and post-procedure. Patients that have venous insufficiency that don't have it corrected are going to get worse. The question is how fast will it get worse and how bad will it ultimately get? And that's dependent on the individual, how much of their problem is hereditary or genetic and how much is occupational. The typical presenting signs and symptoms, which include pain, swelling, restless legs, enlarged refluxing vessels, if you have the venous insufficiency corrected, the, the disease progress will, will completely stop. Um, and if it recurs, it can be easily treated without significant intervention. When you use a laser or radiofrequency ablation to close veins, it's an energy source that produces heat. And so you're essentially burning the veins using radiofrequency or laser. And in order to, to control that pain, you have to put a tumescent solution, which is a numbing medicine mixed with normal saline around the vein all the way up the leg. And so that requires several needle sticks, which is uncomfortable, and then that makes the leg kind of full, maybe a little tight, and there's some leakage of the fluid. And with the Clarivane, that tumescent's not needed because Clarivane basically has a mechanical agitator, like a skip rope that spins inside the vein and traumatizes the lining of the vein and then we inject a sclerosant solution that augments the effect of the skip rope. When you use an energy source, there's always a risk that you could damage a structure that's adjacent to or near to the vein, such as a nerve or maybe even muscle, that sort of thing. And so with Clarivane, since there's no laser, there's no radio frequency, you don't, you're not using a heat source, and so it's I think significantly safer. All of the procedures are very safe statistically. The number of complications is very minimal, but I think there is some benefit with the Clarivane with respect to complications.